What's up, guys? I'm here with Alina Madison. How are you tonight? I'm fine. This is so fun. You look yes, so I... beautiful. Thank you. Right. So do you. Awesome. So when your husband told you about this film that he was producing, what were your first thoughts on it? Well, it is a true story. So I was, I, I, and I knew that you know, dogs, you know, right. I don't want to give the spoilers away or anything like that, but it's just a very meaningful mm -hmm. story. And right. because it is true, it did happen. And then it's just so well done. It's such a beautifully looking film. I mean, Brian obviously is an amazing director mm -hmm. and actor and everyone's going to love this film. I mean, mm -hmm. it just has such a great message. Right. And being an actress yourself, what was kind of like the pointers that you gave to maybe either the cast or to Brian as a producer or anything to oh, contribute no. to the film? They don't, they don't need my advice. No, I mean, no, 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 no. You know what, that's a great compliment though to the cast that The film that will he... speak for itself what he did. So it's, yeah, it's amazing. Amazing. And tell me about all of the things that you have going on. I know that you have a feature film that has a bunch of nominations. Tell me everything. Well, I'm in a film right now called Turnover that's doing the festival rounds, and it's won 10 awards so far, which is amazing for best feature film and um, best uh, family feature film. It's in um, a festival tomorrow and here in LA, and then it's in the Sholo Film Festival in Arizona this weekend, and it's still nominated for a few more awards. And I just came off of a run for a film called Last Call at Murray's that also won a bunch of awards that I won Best Actress for, so wow. it's, been, it's been an amazing run. How does it feel to have that type of honor as your passion. It's well, I mean, it literally yeah. is like a dream come true. Right. Like everybody says, it's like, you know, follow your dream and like if that's what you want to do mm -hmm. in life and then it actually happens. So yeah. it's like, it, it's like very satisfying. It's surreal, but it's like just a really happy time. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else, maybe director wise or writing wise, that you would like to get into outside of acting at all? Or are you very confident with where you're at right now in the acting world? I'm pretty really you're killing it. I'm pretty confident in the acting world. Um, I wouldn't want to direct after right. I've seen like what goes on with exactly, directing. Yeah. I just am not that person. <laughs> um, I actually kind of like the casting process because Ooh. I like to see when actors as an actor right. or an actress to see like what people bring to other right. characters so it's always been really interesting to me and I did cast a couple of commercials just sitting in on yeah. watching the process it's so much and it's so interesting because everybody brings something different to it I mean there's and you'd be amazed of the things that you never think of yeah so I think I mean that it's interesting to watch but I love the acting aspect of it like hands down and I'm sure especially coming from your type of perspective from your own experiences you're able to bring a lot to the table to these up-and-coming actors too I hope so yeah. I mean I mean you know what I think it's like everybody brings like something different there's no like one way to do it right and it just depends on the day, the character, what's going on, how you feel, how the casting people feel, it's like all of it. It's just like a combination. There's no like there's no like one rule to it. So just cool. like with life. Exactly. Yeah. Wise words from this beautiful young lady right here, guys. Thank you. Thank you so Enjoy much for talking film. with us. Thank you. So nice meeting so nice you. Nice to meet you too.